Good morning, and welcome to Camp Kindergarten. All right, let me find us here. Today is Thursday, right? Yes, today is Thursday. So let me open up my feed. Good morning. How is everybody today? We are very glad that you could join us on another day of Camp Kindergarten. I'm going to open up my post here. Good morning, Benny. Good morning, John. So John, I used to teach a baby class, um, a baby and mom class at the park district. And John was in my class and he's watching. So good morning, John. Um, and Angel and Kieran and Kevin and Rune, I think it's somebody's birthday today. And Emmett and Evelyn and Tristan and Isla, and Aria and Reed and Alana and Grandma Kathy. Hey, Grandma Kathy. And Kashav and Lila. Okay, you're gonna go ahead. I can't help you though, but you, so you do, you. And wait for me then. Okay. I'll keep saying hello to everybody while you go to the bathroom. But can you make it a little bit snappy, please? Okay, okay thanks. Good morning, Molly and Bryce and Francesca and Declan, I'm assuming. Isaac and Sophie, Nolan and Heron, Shay and Hugh, Scarlett and Mia, um, Lila, let's see. I really like to be able to look at you, but you guys say good morning so quickly that I just feel like I'm glued to my computer. Natalie, good morning, and Sydney, and Benjamin, and Addison, and Gwendolyn, Wyatt, and Joshua. And let's see, Silvio, and Laura, and Cooper, and Ryu, and Kai, and Hadassah, and Allison. Good morning, I think so far. I've said hello to everybody. Um, good morning, Keely, and Sarah, and um, Andrea or Andrea, I'm not sure how you pronounce it. And Jacob and Kate and Asher and Rishi. Oh my goodness, lots of people tuning in. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Let me grab my guitar. I'm not going to start until Kinsey gets back because um, we're going to start our day on a high note. And if I started before she got back, we would um, see some big emotions, I think. Good morning, Colin and Lila. But I will get ready to start. Good morning, Killian and Barry. Awesome. How is everybody doing today? Um, I don't know about where you are, but the sun is shining. It's a beautiful day. Good morning, Stella and Emery and Jocelyn and Margaret. Let's see if my guitar needs to be tuned while we're waiting for Kinsey. Let's see here. Got my tuner on the end. Good morning, Vivian and Amelia. Let's see here. So if you look at my uh, capo or my um, tuner at the end, good morning, Madeline and Miles and Robert and Leonardo, oops, and Owen and Vivian and Carlos. So once this stops moving, then it's in tune. Good morning, Kabir and Avi and Reese and Riley. I think that one's okay. Good morning, a different Riley in Brooklyn. Did you come on in? What? Miss Barbara's in the bathroom. Okay, go in the live bathroom. Come on, sweetheart. We we'll wait. For yes, I am. I have been waiting for you, and I thought you were going to the bathroom, but you were apparently not going to the bathroom. Um, good morning, Annabelle and um, Ailsa and Ruby and Max. Ruby and Max. I believe that there is a book or a show about a Ruby and a Max. Um, and Hadley and Nicholas. All right, we've got our E, A, G, no, D. Good morning, Kiki, Maeve, and Lila, and Sloan. Oh, thank you, Sloan. Sloan says she likes my hair today. Um, I twisted it up and slept on it last night, and that's what happened. Good morning, Simone, and Vince, and Luke. Let's see, there's that D, G, each, um, each string has a, um, a letter that, it's, that is its name. Um, hi, Noni. Hi, Mom. My mom is watching right now. Um, and good morning, Will. Each one of these strings has its own name. This, this string that's closest to me is called the E string. And then it's A, D, G, B. E, and the way that I was taught to remember that, good morning, Emery and Ethan and Amelia and Lincoln. The way that I was taught to remember that 
is to say, eat a darn good breakfast every day. And each one of those words starts with the letter that is the name of these strings. So eat a darn good breakfast every day. Those are my strings. For those of you who are just joining us, Kinsey had to go to the bathroom and she wanted us to wait until she got back. So we are just stalling a little bit because I told her I would wait. And if I don't wait, when I told her that I would wait, she will get very upset. And that's not really nice. If I told her that I would do something and then I didn't do it, that really wouldn't be very kind of me, now would it? So we're waiting for her. So I'll just say a few more good mornings to Kylie. Oh, thank you, Evelyn. Evelyn likes my hair too. So a little uh, lesson on the guitar. Um, we've got our strings. This right here on my guitar is called the neck of my guitar. What type of animal has a neck that's really long? Good morning, Jessica and Jennifer and Brielle and Kendra. What kind of animal has a really long neck? If you said a giraffe, good job. A giraffe has a very long neck. Um, and an elephant also has a really long trunk. But this is called the neck of the guitar and this is where we play our chords. And Kinsey's back so we're gonna see how we are feeling today. Good morning, Isaiah. And Victoria. Let's see how we're feeling today. Start out by t by wiggling our toes. Hello, everybody. Wiggle your toes. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Hello, everybody. Wiggle your toes. Hello, everybody. Wiggle your toes. Wiggle your toes today. If you have a request, have one of your grown-ups type it in, and maybe I'll get to it today. Let's all touch our noses. Hello, everybody. Touch your nose. Matthias and Delaney. Let's all shrug our shoulders. I like that one. Hello, everybody. Shrug your shoulders. Hello, everybody. Shrug your shoulders. Hello, everybody. Shrug your shoulders. Shrug your shoulders. If you've had a request to click your tongue. a long morning waiting for Kinsey in the bathroom so let's move along to our months of the year are you ready Kinsey are you going to point to the to the words or would you like me to do it Kinsey good morning River and Freya we need to we need to keep moving here sweetheart so 
I'm going to count to three, and if you're not up here, I'm going to do it for you. One, two, thank you, three, a one, a two. Do you want to do it with me up here? Mommy, can you please lift me up? Mommy, can you do it with me up here? Mm -hmm. We're working on using good manners. Mm -hmm. oh. A one, four. a two, a one, two, three, four. January, February, March, April, May. We go outside and play, play, play. June, July, August and September, back to school so we remember. October, November, and December, we know our months so we end the song here. We know our months so we end, ouch, the song here. Can you please finish chewing your vitamins? Okay. Thank you. Until you're done finish chewing your vitamins, I'm going to do them, I'm going to do everything. Okay, you have to get those finished. Okay, let's see. We're going to do our days of the week. And we will do the days of the week. Cha-cha-cha. A Miss Megan original song. Let's see here. Mommy, we already did the days of the week yesterday. We do it every day because every day is a new day. A yeah. one, a two, a one, two, three, four. Days of the week. Mommy, I finished days my of the vitamin. Week. Please don't yell at me like that. Yeah. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Sunday. Hey, Monday. Mommy, I finished my vitamin. Okay, I am getting a little frustrated with you right now because you're interrupting. This is my water, and you just finished your vitamins. And I imagine that you have vitamin pieces and little parts in your mouth. So I do no, not, look. I don't want you, yes, I can see little pieces of vitamin, and I don't want you drinking my water because you're going to get vitamins pieces in my water. Okay, if you would like some water, you may go downstairs and get some, but please don't interrupt. It's very frustrating. Okay? I'm done, look. I understand that. Please don't interrupt. Okay. Thank you. Let's start that over again. One, a two, a one, two, three, four. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Sunday, Monday, cha, cha, cha. Tuesday, Wednesday, cha, cha, cha. Thursday, Friday, cha, cha, cha. Saturday, cha, cha, cha. Days of the week. Days of the week. Yeah. Days of the week. Days of the week. I'm going to scoot you guys a little bit closer so that you can see. Oh, put my pick in my guitar strings. Ooh. I don't know about you, but I've been having a lot of sneezes lately. I think that with the changing weather, I think that I have different allergies that are coming out and about. All right, Kinsey, what day of the week is it today, sweetheart? You know, okay, I guess I do it myself. Today is, let's see, we go and find the next blue space, and where does that go? Pull our finger up, and what? Hey, then go back to the other side. What day of the week is it, Kenzie? Don't look. Don't tell them. Okay, I'll just show them, and maybe they can guess. What day of the week is it today? Can you tell everybody? Thursday. Thursday, very good. Go ahead and put it up there. It looks like we did not brush your hair this morning. Nope. Nope. Okay. Come on, sweetheart. Don't just put it out of my hand while laughing. Okay. Oh, that's not my face. If, if today is Thursday, what was yesterday? We're going that way. We're going to the left. To the left. To the left. To the left. Okay, come on. To the left. Wednesday. Very good. Hey, go. No, go. I'm going to switch something up here because it hasn't really made that much sense in my brain. I'm going to move this all the way over here. here. <clears throat> I'll just make so much more sense to me. And this will go over here. All right. Go ahead and put that up there. I'm going to tell everybody why I just did that. Maybe you can guess why I just did that. Good morning, well, I James. Can reach them. Why did I just change? Why did I just change that? So, so I could reach. Kenzie, 
Sometimes I just change this. Yes, this says yesterday was, today is, and tomorrow will be. And hmm. I can read that from down there. Why do you that think that I moved and I can those around? That from up here. Okay, put it in there, please. Now, put it down, please. In my head, if today is Thursday, what will tomorrow be, Kins? In my head, oh, you guys can't see my brain up there. In my head, um, days of the week move from left to right. And so in my head, I got it up. thank you, sweetheart. This makes much more sense because yesterday was on this side of Thursday, or yesterday was on this side of today, and tomorrow is on the right side of today. So now it kind of makes more sense in our brains. Of and now I can how reach all, all right. So them. repeat after me. Um, today is Thursday. I can't hear you. Today is Thursday. Yesterday was Wednesday. Yesterday was Wednesday. Tomorrow will be Friday. Tomorrow will be. Very good. All right, we are going to look at our calendar now. Or what now? Or what now? Or this? Uh huh. All right, let's figure out what number is going to come in next. What? Can you scoot to the side so everybody can Mommy, see? Mommy, Sunday and Saturday. Oh, and with Y. Oh, that's a great observation. I don't think everybody, all of our friends at home heard you. Can you say that again? Turn to the camera and tell them what you just told me. Did you know that um, Sunday and Saturday both have Y's at the end and S's at the front? Kinsey just said, can you move to the side, that the word Sunday hey. and the word Saturday both start with the letter S. And look at all of the words. What do all of the words end with? Y. Wow. They actually end with D-A-Y because we say Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday. Ooh, I'm hungry. Um, okay, so can you please scoot to the side so everybody can see the numbers and let us all count together. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. How do we make an eight? We make an S and don't be late. Hurry back up and make an eight. Very good. Now, what? Hold on. Today is Friday. Today is Thursday. Now, what is our pattern? Can you? Can we say our pattern? Dark, 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 light. Dark, 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 light. Light. Today we, this month, we have an A, 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 B pattern. That means three in a row of one kind and one of another. Okay, can you put that in there for me, please? Just a reminder, we will not have school on Monday. Oh, Mom, two more, and then one, and three more, and then... Mm -hmm. And tomorrow, I'm very excited to try our virtual apple taste test. If you want to participate, um, your grown-up can get... Four different types of apples. Fuji, Gala, Granny Smith, and Golden Delicious. Four types of apples. And we're going to try, I've never done this on Camp Kindergarten before, but we're going to try a taste test. And if you want to participate, then you can have apples at home and we'll taste them at the same time. And then we'll talk about it. If you don't want to participate, that's okay. And if you want to use different apples, that's okay too. But these are the four apples we're going to use, and then we're going to take a vote on which of those four apples we like the best. All right, we need to figure out what's the weather, what's the weather, what's the weather like today? Is it sunny, is it rainy, is it snowy out today? What's the weather, what's the weather, what's the weather like today? Is it cloudy? Is it windy? Is it foggy out today? Hey, kids, what is the weather like where we are today? Kinsale, what's the weather like today? It's 
take a peek outside. Let's take a peek outside. Not my outside. Yours. Not mine. Yours. What do you mean, not mine, yours? Yours. On TV. Let's go watch. Huh? They can look out their windows. Oh, they're going to look at their windows. Okay. Not ours. Um, good morning, Hadassah and Maddie. Oh, Maddie told you that um, your shirt is beautiful today, Kinsey. Thank what do you say to... Come over here. What do you say to Maddie? Thank you, and my sister's wearing a match. Say it. Thank you, Maddie, for the compliment. Thank you, Maddie, for the compliment. My sister's wearing the same shirt. Ah. All right. Um, Kinsey's going to figure out what the weather is like where we are. What's the weather like where you are? So far, October is shaping up here in Lake Bluff to be a beautiful month. Oops. Okay. I think... What do you think, Kins? What's the weather like here? Do you see any trees moving in the, in the, is it windy out? No. Nope. Is it sunny out? Yes. Oh yeah, it is sunny and beautiful. Yet again. Oh, but it's I still feel like I have to too. snow. It's not gonna be cold today. That it's going to be, cool. actually I think it's going to be warm today. We're gonna get outside. Well, like we're gonna jump in the swimming pool. Um, not like we're going to jump in the swimming pool. Like, maybe I'll wear my short sleeves and pants. Maybe I'll wear short sleeves and shorts. I definitely don't need my does swimming suit. it starts with a W? It does start with a W. Warm starts with W, W, W. All right. Where did Wallace's markers go? Oh, here they are. All right. Kins, can I fill in the sunny while you're doing that so that we can move along here? And then we're going we're gonna to do a um, <laughs> song. <laughs> All right, sunny and warm it is. Can I fill this in? Wait, mom, 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 mom. Did you know that sunny starts with a letter S? Oh, good observation. Kinsey just said that sunny starts with the same sound as Sunday and Saturday. What sound makes the s sound? S. S. Very good. Can you please color this in? Okay. Hold your marker the right way, please. Thank and you. let's see which one. Not them is being the biggest instead of Clyde. Ooh, Alana wants you to know that she has a unicorn dress on today. So you guys kind of match because you both have unicorns. What do you say to Alana? Thank you, Alana. Say, Alana, that's pretty cool. Alana, that's pretty cool. I can do okay, it. Okay, finish up, please. I like getting it on top. Okay. All right, good girl. Thank you. Click it, club. I want to do it. Can I say do it? Yeah. There it is. Awesome. All right, it's time for a song. And guess what song we're going to do right now? The Bumblebee. No. What song has the letter C in the title? What song that we like to do that's a fan favorite has a k in the name? Maybe something like the... Dinosaur. Not the dinosaur song. The k k Cat song. The cat came back. Back. I gotta find it. Back. Cat came back. That's the one that you were talking about? Yep. And that's the one I was talking about. Because dinosaurs mean cat. What do you think? Cat means dinosaurs. What do you think? What song do you think we're going to do tomorrow? Yesterday we did the book, book, bumblebee song. Today we're going to do the k -k cat came back. What song do you think we might do tomorrow? The dinosaur. And we're going to do the war. And we'll probably do the war. Why, would, why do you think we're going to do the dinosaur song tomorrow? Because it starts with the letter D. Because it starts with the letter D. And then comes E, and then comes G. Yeah, I don't know if we have a song but for mom, all those letters. But mom, 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 what? I'm listening. Can you not do the war so loud? Tomorrow I won't. All right, this song okay. is an old song that was covered by, or redone by Lori Berkner Band, and we have also redone it as well. <laughs> And you can find this on music platforms everywhere under Miss Megan's Camp Kindergarten Volume 1 under the artist name Meg, the letter N, Doug. Here we go!
back. Yeah. You're right. needed movement break. Can you please move that? I need to put my guitar on that and move. Cover it all up. Okay, take that off of there, please. I have a stand for my guitar so that I don't have to lay it down. It sits, stands up in the, um, on, my, on my stand, on my guitar stand. You can see what she's saying. All right. We need to see how many days we've been in school. Let's do this quickly, Kins. We're going to add one more straw. To our ones cup. All right, let me check that out. Make sure. Dun, 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 dun. Yep. Good morning, Jordan. Ooh. And Cameron, Nicole. Good morning. And Tali, Tally, Tally, and Shira. And uh, oh yeah, we had lots of cat came back. All right, Kinsey, can you scoot to the side? Remember, we have to sit to the side so all of our friends at home can see what we're doing. Scoot, scoot, scoot. Thank you. Did you add a one in there yet? No, you did not. We need to add one straw. I'm going to let you do it. Oh. Okay, next time we should get this out ahead of time. Can you find it? All right. We're going to add one straw. Is it going to go in the hundreds? Hundreds bin, the tens bin, or the ones bin, Kinsey? The ones. the ones bin. Can you please add that to the ones bin? All right, so can, well, let's see here. How many ones are in here? One, two, three. So Kinsey changed. Okay, sweetheart, I need you to scoot over just a little bit. Thank you. Kinsey changed this number from a two to a three because there are three. Once. Kinsey, how many 10 packs are in here? Two. Two. One, two. So we have a two in front of here. So let's count and see how many days we have been in camp kindergarten. Now we're going to start by counting. No, Mommy, I know what it is. It's 23. That's right, but I'm going to show everybody why it's 23. Because they both. Wait, we're going to start wanna, with our 10 packs. I want to do it. I want to do it. Okay. 10. 20. 20. Now we're gonna count by ones. 21, 22, 23. 23 days. And a two and three makes it. Kindergarten. A two and three makes it. It goes this way. That's what it's. Okay. That's what it's. A two and a three. Very good. And guess what? Guess who has 23 body parts today? Clara the counting. Clara the counting caterpillar. I'm gonna show everybody. We're gonna do this real fast. You put the sticky tack on there while I show, show everybody Clara. Ooh. Clara, the counting caterpillar, there she is. Ooh, sorry, I think I moved that a little too fast. Look at all those body parts. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22. And let's go over here and let us see if we can figure out the pattern. Let's start with cowboy boots. Cowboy boots, slippers, dress shoes, rain boots, sneakers. Cowboy boots, slippers, dress shoes, rain boots, sneakers. Cowboy boots, slippers, what comes next? Dress shoes. If you said dress shoes, you are correct. That means you are right. All right. Flip this up a little bit so we can see. 
All right, kids. Call you if you can get the vaccine. Yes, one time a month we have um, uh, a very lovely lady come and help clean the house, and she's here today. Her name is Miss Barbara. All right, you got that on there? Stick it all up. Stick it up. Clara the Counting Caterpillar, 23. And you're right, she has dress shoes. Ooh. That's what we were talking about. Clara sure is getting long, isn't she? Whoa. Her body is getting long. Very long, body part after body part. Guess what? It's time for Cam the Cook. It's time for Cam the Cook. Woohoo! It's time for Cam the Cook. It's time for Cam the Cook. Oh yeah, it's time for Cam the Cook. It's time for Cam the Cook. Hello! It's time for Cam the Cook. It's time for Cam the Cook. Hello, boys and girls. It's so good to see you. Cam, I am just always impressed by how much energy you have. I know, it's because I eat a very big and delicious breakfast. You know, Miss Megan, I love to cook. I know you love to cook. It's in your name. Cam, the cook. Yes, you're right. <laughs> how are you today? I'm swell. How are you, Miss Megan? Um, I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Um, would you like to help us again today with our morning message? Hey, oh, I would be... Delighted. I got a great idea, Cam. You have a great idea, Kenzie? What's you your great idea? Count. You um, read the message and I'll find the letters. Kenzie, I think that is a splendid idea. I'll read the message right now and Kenzie will find the C's. Here we go. And we're going to use. Are you listening? Are you ready? Here we go. Dear class, Dear class. today is Thursday, October 8th. Today is Thursday, October 8th. Cam the Can you please stop? Please? Thank you. Cam the Cook likes to read Pete the Cat books and count by fives. Cam the cook likes to read Pete the cat books and count by fives. Love Miss Megan. Love Miss Megan. Love Miss Megan. That's right. Cam the cook, you like to read Pete the cat books? Oh, Miss Megan, Pete the cat, he is one cool cat. Whoa. I think so too. Guess what? We have a Pete the Cat book ready for us to read today. Ooh, you do? Yes, we do. Oh, Miss Megan. Oh, I'm so excited. Oh, my goodness. Oh, oh, my goodness. And there are pumpkins on it. Oh, I can't wait. I can't wait. I can't wait. Oh, Cam, I think you need to settle down a little bit. I know. I know. Okay, ready? In through the nose. Out through the toes. Out <laughs> through the toes? What does that mean? Well, when you sit there, you bring the, no the air through your nose and you visualize that it goes all the way through your body and out through your toes. Do you want to try it? Yeah, I do want to try that. Okay, here we go. Get ready. Sit up nice and tall or crisscross applesauce. All right, Miss Megan, take a deep breath in through your nose. Let it out. All right, so Cam, you're saying I should take a deep breath in through my nose. And in my brain, think like it's going all the way through my body and out through my toes. You got it. That's exactly what I want you to try to do. Okay, let's try it again. All right, here we go. You want to help us out at home? You want to try it with us at home? All right, so we're going to breathe in through our nose. Pretend like it's going through our body and bl blow it out and it comes out through your toes. Pretty fun. Thanks. All right. Uh, Kinsey, we need to make a capital. We need to find all the capital letter C's. Do you remember what a C looks like? We say, we're going to put, well, I guess we'll put it up here. The sky and the fence. Nope. 
I'll use my green shoulder to the ground next. And there, yes. Can I use your red, please? <laughs> All right. The I'm capital sure. letter C. And my blue. Starts and it goes up to the sky. And a backward circle to the ground. Can you try that with me? Up to the sky. Backward circle to the ground. All right, kids. I need you to find all the capital letter C's. There's a lot of them off of my eyes. How many lowercase C's? We'll get to the lowercase C's in a minute. All right. Can you tell me? Can I tell you what? How many lowercase? No, we're not doing the lowercase C's right now. We're doing the uppercase C's. No, but can you tell me how many? I don't know how many there are. I didn't look yet. Can you find those capital letter C's, kids? What color are you going to use? Come on, sweetheart. Find those capital letter C's. Don't look, Cam. Okay, Cam is covering his eyes. Oh, I can't wait to see how many capital letter C's there are. Do, 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 do. Keep Can going. Pee. He's not. I do, can do, pee do, 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 Nope, okay. I'll keep my eyes covered. Sweetheart, don't do that, please. Don't do that. Don't do that. All right. Kinsey, are you ready? Did you guys all find all the capital letter C's? Can I find them? Yes, you did. You can open your yes, we eyes. Are. Oh, great job, Kins. Let's count them all. Can you please scoop over so that your friends at home can see and put that cap back on the marker, please, so that you don't accidentally get the marker on the chair Two or the ground. Four. One, two, three, four. There are four capital letter C's. Did you find them all? What do we say? Down and over and down some more. That's the way we make a four. That's kind of like a little dance. Down and over and down. Well, da, 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 da. Cam, you have some awesome dance moves, thanks. All right. We had four. Where's the lid? Thank you. We had four capital letter C's. Now, Kinsey, can you please find all of the... Oh, that's too cool. Can you please find all of the lowercase c's? Hey. Yeah, we're not using that blue. We're going to use this blue. A lowercase c is just like a capital C. Only it's in between the fence and the ground. Please find the lowercase c's. All right, we got that uppercase c this time. Last time we Can't forgot. Can't close one. your eyes. Okie dokie. Um, thank you, Kashav and Big Sisters, or Big Sis Sammy. Is that first? Thank you for that compliment. I appreciate that. Um, there are, s oh, angels ahead of us right now. All right, how many lowercase c's are there? Did you find them all? There's one very tricky one. It's hidden in the middle of a word. Can you find it? Don't look, Mommy. I'm not looking. Okay, are you done? <gasps> you found them. Okay, you got them all. Good job. Yes, sit down, please. You can open your eyes. Oh, nice job. Let's count. One, two, there are two lowercase c's. So, we are going to add ah, these two together. Around the tree, around yeah. the tree. No, how do we make a two? What do we say? We say, around and back on the railroad track. Two, two. Look. All right, let's count them all. One, two, two three, four. Five, six. There are six uh, C's all together. All right. Come on, How do we make a six? A line and a loop. Mr. Six, roll the hoop. A line and a loop. I made, a, I made that. Roll the hoop. That's okay. To go on. Okay, thank you. All right. Can, can the cook. I could get my I'm sorry, Kins. Can the cook. 
Um, I taught all of our friends yesterday a um, five-pack chant. Would you like to hear it? Oh, that would be awesome. I would love to hear it. All right. Let's show everybody our five-pack um, chart, and then we'll say our five-pack chant because, Cam, it seems like you like to count by fives. Oh, yes, I love counting by fives. Can you all help me out by counting by fives? All right. Here we go. Let's see if you remember our chant from yesterday. Kinsey, are you ready? Ready. Here we go. It goes like this. Five, ten, fifteen, twenty, twenty-five, thirty, thirty-five, forty, forty-five, fifty, fifty-five, sixty, sixty-five, seventy, seventy-five, eighty, eighty-five, ninety, ninety-five, one hundred. All right, can you try that with us? We'll go a little bit slower, okay? Mommy, All right. Mommy, that's what I was trying to sing in my head while I was asleep. Oh, you were trying to sing that in your head while you were asleep? Yep. That's really nice. So I know the song. Okay, you let's all try it together. 100. Here we go. 5, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, 35, 40, 45, 50, 55, 60, 65, 70, 75, 80, 85, 90, 95, 100. Very nice job. Oh, boys and girls, you did such a great job counting by fives. Good morning, Emma. All right, let's see here. I think that we've had a couple requests and now is a great time to do it. So, uh, we are gonna do the Tootie Tom. Oh, I just love the Tootie Tom, Miss Megan. It is so much fun. I'm gonna watch. Okay, Kinsey, you can join us. Join me, we'll do it together. Tootie Tom. The Tootie Tom. All right, we had lots of requests. Everyone stand up to do If you are at home, stand on up. Uh-uh, no thank you. And, let us do the tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. I'm not gonna stand up because otherwise they can't see my head. A tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs out. Then you say thumbs, thumbs out. Yeah. And then we do it together. I don't like saying the word. Well, I need you to do the words so that everybody knows how to do it. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs out. Yeah. Elbows, back. Elbows back. You can stand at home. I'm just kneeling, otherwise my head's not in the picture. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs up. Elbows back. Elbows well, I guess I kind of need to stand up, don't I? Knees together. Knees together. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs out. Thumbs out. Elbows back. Elbows back. Knees together. Knees together. Tushy out. Tushy out. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs out. Thumbs out. Elbows back. Elbows back. Knees together. Tushy out. Tushy out. Tongue out. Mm -hmm. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. A tootie ta, a tootie ta, a tootie ta ta. Thumbs out. Thumbs out. Elbows back. Elbows back. Knees together. Knees together. Tushy out. Tushy out. Tongue out. Tongue out. Turn around. Close your eyes. Oh, we have to close our eyes. Close your eyes.
Knees together. Knees together. Tushy out. Tushy out. Tongue out. Tongue out. Eyes closed. Turn around. Sit down. Whew. That was so fun. All right, I'm gonna move you guys closer again. Hey! Yeah. takes a while to clean a house. All right. Nice job. Oh, you guys are pointing up a little high. Scooch down. All right. Oh, Miss Megan, that was so silly. I just love silly things. Do you like tooting? That's not appropriate, Kinsale. But that's a tooting talk. Kinsey. But that's a tooting talk. Uh, Miss Megan, doing silly things makes me feel really happy. I know. It makes me feel happy, too. So great. Good job. All right, I need to get going. I'm going to listen to your Pete the Cat book, and then I'm going to head down and start baking some c -c -c cookies. Oh, Cam, can you bake some for me, please? Oh, yes, because guess what? My oven is broken. What? Yeah, your oven is broken? Whatever will you do? Well, I have to wait for it to get fixed. Oh. That is and so sad. Can you make some for me and make it fixed? Sure, I'll make you some cookies. Yeah. Well, Miss Megan, I hope you get your oven fixed soon. I know, I have to use a stove for all of our all of our dinners um, because the oven doesn't work. I have to wait like two more weeks. I don't think I could handle that. I know, good thing it's not your oven. Yes, you can borrow my oven if you'd like. Oh, thanks, that's really nice of you, Cam. Um, it's very nice to help others when they are in need, isn't it? Yep, that's what we should all be doing. <laughs> I know. All right. We'll I'm see you later, Cam. Bye, boys and girls. Yeah, Good to see you. Um, High fives, kids. Uh, Bye. Boop. Oh, Kinsey, you're the best. Goodbye, boys and girls. Boop. Bye. All right. Thanks, Cam, for joining us. Yeah. Okie dokies. It is time yeah. for us to read like. Pete the Cat Five Little Pumpkins oh, by James. Dean. Yes, we, we did this book before, and Cam will cook, but before he's going to bed, he's going to listen to the Cam the Cook book. Okay. Well, he's he's listening, um, but then he's going to scoot on out. Pete the Cat. Five Little Pumpkins. Why do you think we chose this book today? Because it's almost Halloween. Well, it's getting closer to Halloween, but what letter does cat start with? What letter? C. A C. Very good. Pete the cat. But why didn't C start with the letter? Five Mommy, little. What, why Kenzie? Didn't C start with the letter? What? Why doesn't C start with the letter C? I don't think I understand your question. Why doesn't C start with the letter C? Mm -hmm. You mean when you say the word, when you say C, you don't, it doesn't start with K. Is that what you're asking me? I have no idea. That's just the way our language was made, and that's what makes it tricky sometimes. Five little pumpkins. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five. Sitting on a gate. The first one said, Oh my, it's getting late. Look at, there's Pete the Cat's watch. I believe, according to this, it's 11 o'clock. That's really late. My bedtime. No, that is not your bedtime. That's, that's past, past my bedtime. That's past your bedtime. It's past my bedtime. The it's second shh, the second one said. What do you think the second one said? They're the witch. Uh -huh. There are witches in the air. Is it really? It's, it's toad. Toad's in the air, isn't he? Toad, toad. The third one said, Oh, but we don't care. Yeah. The fourth one said. Let's run and run and run. Can pumpkins run? Um, That's pretty goofy, isn't it? The fifth one said, look at he looks like a pirate pumpkin. Yeah, that's, there's another pirate pumpkin. The fifth one said, I'm ready for some fun. Look, he has his trick-or-treat bag. Trick-or-treat, trick-or-treat. <laughs> trick and the little birdie has her trick-or-treat bag. Has Ooh! 
Ooh, and the wind. Look at all the pumpkins. Look at the wind blowing and all the pumpkins are about to roll over. <gasps> and out went the light. Look at their faces are still glowing. <laughs> and the five little pumpkins. Hey, the boy turned on the splash. Mm -hmm. Rolled. Out of sight. Did they roll like like a ball rolls, or did they roll on their skateboards? They rolled on their skateboards. Yeah. All right. I'm gonna read this book one more time, but I'm gonna read it a little bit more fluidly. Okay. Pete, Pete the Cat, Five Little Pumpkins by James Dean. There are not very many words on each page, so um, I'll be flipping the pages more. pretty quickly. Five little pumpkins sitting on a gate. The first one said, "Oh my, it's getting late." The second one said, there are witches in the air. Third one said, but we don't care. The fourth one said, let's run and run and run. The fifth one said, I'm ready for some fun. Woo went the wind and out went the light. And the five little pumpkins rolled out of sight. Do you see why I did that nice and slow to begin with? Because if I read it like this, you guys wouldn't be able to see. Oh, happy Halloween. You guys wouldn't be able to see the pictures very easily because I'd have to flip through them so fast. Mom, All right. Mom, yes, in, where's yes, Toad? Susan. What? Where's the witch? Where is Toad? Toad? I don't know. All right. We are going to do... Um, I guess that would work. Oh, there it is. All right, we're going to review this. I forgot to do it the first four weeks. So, letter A, we say A, 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 A. We're taking a bite of an apple. B, for like a baseball, we say B. And then we pretend like we're swinging a bat. B, B, B. C and K make the same sound. And these right here are a musical instrument called a castanet. You can either pretend to use your castanet or you can pretend like you're a k -k crab. I might change that picture to a crab because that makes more sense. And we're going to go like this. Because crabs have hands. Or they don't have hands. Crabs have claws and their claws go like this. So go. K -k -k. No, they go like this. They do. <laughs> Can you do this? <laughs> I don't know why that's striking me funny, but it's funny. Um, all right, let's review those <laughs> three letters. Um, a, 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 a. B, b. B, b, b. C, <laughs> I think we have a performer on our hands. All right, nice job. Okay, we're going to do a quick analogy because we haven't done one of those in a while either. All right. Our analogy for today is, let me cover up the other ones. All right, Kins, you ready? I have to cover up them. I have this. This is good. But this. No, that one's tricky to use. All right. That one's a B one. All right, Kins, come look at our analogy. Ow. Now, remember, when we have an analogy, my, uh, my my copier doesn't my printer works but the copier portion of the printer doesn't still doesn't work so this is what we have to do instead all right we have <clears throat> can, can you hold this right here for me so that they can't see the top yes but hold it onto the book too right here hold no, bring your hand down there we go thank you all right we have when we have an analogy these two things are related these two things are related just like these two things are related and these two things are related. So let's see here. Milk is to cow as egg is to what? What is the relationship, Kinsey, between milk and cow? The, the cow makes the milk ah, out you, of its body. The cow makes the milk out of its body. That's right. We of, get of milk what? from cows. And, and the cows eat grass to make well, milk. Yeah, well, 
Okay. So, oof. let's see what our choices are. Milk is to cow, as egg is to squirrel? No. No, that doesn't make a lot of sense. Milk is to cow, as egg is to dog? No. No. Dog? Milk is to cow, as egg is to goat? Nope. Nope. And milk is to cow, as egg is to hen? Yes. Why? Because hens are like chickens. Okay, and how does that, why does that fit in that spot? Since it's a, a hen, the hens come out of eggs when they're eggs. babies. Eggs, uh, okay. So, milk... And hens lay Ah, eggs. there we go. Milk comes from cows, just like eggs come from... Chickens. Hens, right? Very good. Nice job, everybody. Oh, ow. All right, we are going to sing one last song because we had a request for it. i got to find it. Uh, there it is. Oh, it's in, I'm, it's in my, um, I have a very big uh, notebook that I keep all of my stuff in for kindergarten, along with my birthdays, and it's out here. Uh, Mommy, I found something you might This is my camp kindergarten notebook. See how big it is? It has my birthdays. It has some lesson planning. Mommy, what, sweetheart? I think you need to put this unstable to go to all right, here's the Halloween song. Oh, there's a crab. Good job. You're right. We do need to put that in there. All right. This is the Halloween song. Remember, this is a Miss Megan original. It's not up yet because I still need in, in the middle of recording it. But the first part is a little spooky sounding. And then the chorus gets silly. Are you ready? It's time for Halloween. Spooky jack o
there. Boom, bada, boom. All right, let me find my page with all my birthdays on it. There it is. All right, we have a couple birthdays today. Zach is turning four. Happy birthday, buddy. Declan is turning four. Ruby is turning five. Jasmine is turning five. And Zane is turning seven. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday if it's your birthday. Happy birthday to you. All right, remember, what makes you different is what makes you beautiful. Tomorrow, apple taste test. Gala, Fuji, Granny Smith, Golden Delicious. I hope that you will be able to join us. We will see how this goes. Um, have a wonderful day, and we'll see you tomorrow. Toodaloo!